Hi everyone, welcome to episode 3 of my Squibonauts Unlimited Let's Play! And to start off, I'm gonna do a couple of requests that you guys left in the comments the last episode. So, the first one is from Eddie Ramirez. Who is obviously a... what is he? No, he's obviously a Alien vs Predators fan. So he wants me to make a Xenomorph. I'll just make it a peaceful Xenomorph Warrior. You guys know who this is, right? Or do you guys recognize what this thing is? Oh, yeah. There it is. And then make a predator. Like alien versus predator. And here it is. The two rivals. Oh, hey, stop! Predator? Hmm. Yeah, you ride that, alien. And then power loader. Not really too sure what pow power lord loader is, or who it is, or what it is. I know it's in the movie. So there you go, Eddie Ramirez. These three things you told me to spawn. Next! Um, it's from Gilbert Dismount. Gilbert Chung, he wants me to make Superman. Mm. Yeah, Superman. Superman versus Slender Man. Let's see how that goes. Oops. Slender Man. Okay, here it goes. No, no, no. Superman! Oh, yes, go, Superman, go! Okay, I need to. I need to get out of here. Look what you did to the old lady! Oh gosh. I can't fix the old lady. She's stuck upside down. But it looks like at this rate, uh, Slender Man's the winner, so... I will... Yeah, unfortunately, Superman is not as strong as Slender Man, so... It's time to help him out. Diamond Sword! Okay, let's sneak attack. ATTACK! Let's do it, Spider! I mean, Superman! Uh-oh. Uh-oh! No! Okay, that just did not work out for me. Okay, well we get the points. Slender Man wins. But yeah. Next request, next and last request by Tranquil1233. Ride a big banana. Ride a big banana. Okay, I'll just do ride a big banana. Ride a bull big banana. Yeah! Rideable banana! How come I can't jump? Banana! Banana! How cool is this? But it would be way cooler if it was... If it was... Gar... Gargantuan. Gargantuan? Oh no, not me! Oh my gosh, I did not mean for that to happen. Remove that. Remove that. That's kind of cool though, but uh, not what I was trying to go for. Dismount. Let's add an adjective. Gar- Writable. Gargantuan. Flying. Fast. There. Hey! No, I did not want to grab it. I want to ride it! Okay, let's go, everyone! So, Tranquil, I'm just gonna be riding your banana. Oh, wait. Aha. No, ignore what I said. Ignore what I said. I'm gonna be riding the banana you told me to make. So let's go! And once again, I'm not gonna lie, this is the second time I'm rec actually the third time I'm recording it because both times before I did not press the record button like a total noob. And now, I have to do this again. 
and it doesn't even tell me what they want so I guess I just have to do it anyway this kid wanted me to put a flag up this case wanted me to put something in it so I put a tarantula my favorite insect ever class pet and then what did this guy want oh he didn't make it. he wants to make everyone laugh I didn't do that, so I will give him... What did I give him? Spitballs? I'll give him a spitball. Oh, he, he turned to a clown. What does she want? I want to meet someone in the middle of their career. Okay, a hospital resident. How about that? Nope. Intern. Oh, intern. How about that? Intern. Uh oh. Career day. I don't know. I have no idea what's going on. Oh, I guess I can't do it. I already did everything. This kid threw up because I gave him the wrong food or whatever. This is the new playground that I made for them and. Let's just do this mission thing that, that, um, wait a minute, where's the mission? Oh, it's right there in the beginning. Let's do the mission and then we'll move on to the next area. Experiment in mad science. Help the student win the science fair by creating a dastardly creature. Dastardly? I don't know what that means, but it's alright. It's the annual school science fair. Help the student win by creating a life form. First, give the paramecium a source of nutrition. Source of nutrition? So, what do you guys think a uh, paramecium eats or whatever? Do you guys know what a paramecium is? That's a paramecium. Okay, I, I don't really know what a paramecium is, but it's just look it up on Google tell me. Anyway, I expect them to eat bread, because, like, who doesn't eat bread? Ducks eat bread, mold eat bread, and I eat bread. So, who doesn't? Now it needs some heat to help it grow. What's hot? A baked potato is pretty hot, right? I know in the old days, people put baked potatoes in their pockets to keep warm. Or at least that's what my teacher told me, not sure if that's true. And look! Wow, it's starting to grow! Next, I should give it something a creature's body would need. I put fish scales. Or maybe I should put lizard scales. Nope, I guess not. Fish scale! Here you go. Now it's really starting to grow! Next, I should help integrate it into society. So... Um, I just added an adjective. I made it smart. And now it's hideously ugly. Lastly, I should give it a name. Place letters on the canvas, then flip the switch. Well, that hideous thing looks almost like this. I'm about to name it. Let me know if you know the answer before I actually finish. That's right, it's Navi! Do you guys know who Navi is? Well, if you don't know who's le what Legend of Zelda is, then I guess you don't know who Navi is, but Navi is... Yeah, it's... Never mind, just figure it out. Uh, interact. Alright, Navi's the little fairy that follows things around. And it's, it's the thing that says, Hey! Hey! Or whatever. Hey! The, you probably heard it from Chris's videos, it's like our text tone, when we get a text message, so yeah. Pick up, and let's move on! Alrighty. Let's go, people. Let's get out of here. Now this kid... I know, um... 
this kid, this other kid is blocking him, so I just put the principal in front. Go! That's right. Anyway, that little thing's my little brother. Apparently, it's my little brother. Now this. Okay, fine, let's do it. I didn't do it in the video, so let's just out with the old. Ooh. Ew. Ew, I know. It is time to improve this neighborhood. Start by bringing down this old building. So, we need a wrecking ball. Okay, not the wrecking ball. I need the machine to hit it with. Oh, whatever. Let's just use TNT and drop it in front and wait for it to... Yeah! Wait for that to happen. Ah. A new structure needs to occupy the empty lot. Create a place that the citizens would enjoy. Uh, what would people enjoy? Amphitheater. Aha! Aha! It's opening day! Spread the word that the new building is ready to use. Billboards! Board. <laughs> Ew! What the heck? Yeah, if I saw those, I would not want to go anywhere near them. Whatever. Yeah, that's, that's, not, that's not pretty. Not at all. Okay, moving on, moving on. Let's go in the restaurant. Um, did I do something here? Yeah, I did this. Feed the hungry guests. Dinner service start. Start as in, yeah, okay. This restaurant has very different customers. Feed the schoolboy something to help him grow. So, kids, you know what my parents always told me helps you grow? Milk! So, if you want to grow big and tall, drink a lot of milk. Ah. Ah, and apparently it gives him muscles. Healthy food inspired me to grow up strong. Good for you. The vampire wants to try something new. Give him something to quench his thirst. Well, Mr. Vampire. Since I know you like blood, how about cranberry juice instead of blood? Ah. Ah. It's good, I know. That was delicious! Thanks for showing me a friendlier alternative. No problem. The robot is here for an upgrade. Feed it something a robot might eat. What do robots eat, people? No, not people, but like, what do they eat, everyone? I think they eat... They eat... Toaster ovens. Do you think that's what they would eat? Toaster ovens? Eat it! Eat it! Okay, I guess not. They will eat... Motor oil. Oh. Okay. Oil can. Okay, fine. They eat batteries. How about that? Battery. Eat this. I fused with your robot food and upgraded to an android. I like androids. I like Android 18. Do you guys do know who Android 18 is? The cannibal has shown up for the special. Write something for the cannibal to dine on. Do you guys know what cannibals are? They're not really pleasant. Cannibals would eat brain, right? They would eat brain. Mm. Nothing. Get out of here, cannibal. That's just what I needed. Hmm, you look pretty tasty too. See you next week. I'm not tasty. I'm not tasty. Anyway, 
If you don't, if you don't know what a cannibal is, a cannibal is a person who eats meat, special meat. Never mind. Maybe I shouldn't tell you what it is. One more. I have to extinguish this for him. Did I really spell it wrong? Uh, this game's gonna make me look like a bad speller. Ew. Maggot. Attack the maggot. I don't like maggots. Hey! Stop it! Did you know a baby fly is a maggot? Actually, a lot of flies' babies are maggots, but anyway. Uh, let's probably do this. Chef's Apprentice. Give the chef ingredients to make meals for each customer. And this is probably going to be the last mission thing, so... Hey, everyone! Is that a gamer? Give ingredients to the chef to make different dishes. Begin by adding three components of a pizza. So, people... Pizza... Needs cheese. No, it needs mozzarella. I don't know how to spell it. Mozzarella. Mozzarella. It sounded squishy. Cheese is a standard on most pizzas. Yes, and so is pizza dough. Fine dough. Dough! Just looks like mozzarella again. And it's also squishy. This will create the pizza crust! And what pizza is not complete without tomato... Tome, tomato sauce. Looks like ketchup, but there we go. Yo, man, you like pizzas? This will help make the sauce. The pizza now needs a secret ingredient! Use the notepad to add that something special! Well, okay. I'm gonna tell you something about Japan pizzas. So in Japan, some special pizzas... I mean, there are pizzas that have shrimp in it. Might sound weird. Ugh, is that really a shrimp? Okay, whatever. That's a shrimp. Add the shrimp. So yeah, in Japan, I've tasted shrimp pizza and it was so good! That pizza looks delicious! Mm. Now we will bake a phoenix for the witch. Add ingredients to make this a magical bird. Well, okay. It need a phoenix. It's made out of fire. This will add a fiery component to a phoenix. And a phoenix is a bird, so birds all have feathers. Or at least a lot of them have feathers. Take that feather. This will add feathers to the phoenix. And a beak. Birds need beaks, right? They need beaks to eat. You added a general component for creating a bird. Woo! There's the phoenix! We picked the phoenix, though it still looks a little raw. Okay. Oh! Mm. Hey! Looks like these things have a way of working themselves out. Hey, you just wasted a phoen- uh, Phoen- uh. Our last customer wants us to bake a motorcycle. Place three ingredients in the oven to create one. Well, who knew you bake motorcycles? I sure didn't. You need a engine. Uh, what else do you need? You added power source for the bike. You need wheels. Tires. Tires, I meant. You need a tire. And this will help the motorcycle roll. You need what else does a motorcycle need? 
Motorcycle chair seat thing. Okay, how about a seat? No, no. Eh, whatever. Just, just take it. You know what I meant. Now the driver will have a place to sit. It's coming, it's coming! This bike looks too good to give away. See ya! Yoink. Hey! Yeah, uh, ma'am, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, but the chef decided he wants- Hey! You're just ignoring me! I said sorry! Oh well. I got what I wanted. Okay, so that ends this episode. Uh, let me know what you guys want to see in the comments below. If you want me to make anything special. Um, yeah. If you want to see anything special, just let me know and I will pick three random requests and I'll do it. And if you have a question for me, just ask a question. Don't forget to follow me on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. And check out kristenmite.com for more information about the lovely tracking network. And I'll see you guys next time. Like, tomorrow maybe. And I'm gonna upload another video. Maybe. I don't know. Okay, I'll see you guys later. And hope you come back. Bye.